You know evil. Subscribe now. We've all been there, feeling stressed, scared, nervous, ashamed or embarrassed. Any strong emotion can induce blushing. That includes hearing a flattering remark, making a speech, being the center of attention, or feeling self-conscious. Getting angry can bring on a blush too. In every case, the face turns various shades of crimson. Science doesn't have all the answers about blushing. Medical people say that blushing is a result of both the fight-or-flight response and social behavior. Fight-or-flight is a theory that animals react to threats with a reaction of nervous system that prepares the animal for fighting or fleeing. Blushing in human is triggered by social situations, not threats to health or life. Animals don't blush. So even though some responses may be inherited traits from our distant past, Blushing in human is related to something animals don't have, namely a moral consciousness. The body secretes more adrenaline as part of the sympathetic nervous system response. The system is involuntary. You don't have to think about it. The pupils of the eye grow bigger, allowing you to take in more visual information. The capillaries that carry blood to the skin widen. There is increased blood flow to the neck and limbs. The heart rate increases and breathing becomes faster. The blood vessels in the face dilate, opening to more blood flow, and the face reddens. Blushing is more noticeable in people who have fair skin. Northern Europeans, Nordic, English, and German people generally fall in this category. There can be other reasons for a red face. People who suffer from hypertension may show a reddened complexion, and as the body heats up during exercises, it tries to cool down both by sweating and by sending more blood to the surface of the skin. Alcohol can cause arteries to widen too. Some Asian populations don't have the ability to break down alcohol in the liver. The toxic materials enter the bloodstream and causes blushing.